guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's day in the life i am just hanging out with juniper right now rowan is still sleeping i decided to put a little bit of makeup on today because i'm feeling like my self-confidence is not at its highest right now and i just want to feel cute so there you go i had not scheduled to vlog today but i woke up this morning and i was like you know what i want to vlog i want to hang out with the vlog fam so here we are i don't really have a lot of activities planned i feel like that's kind of been the story for the last couple of vlogs and i apologize if that's boring but that's just kind of the stage of life that i'm in like everything feels a little bit chaotic and i have not been planning as much i certainly don't have as much time for like DIYs on my own stuff like that just because the kids are in a really demanding stage of life right now so you're getting some realistic mom life just us you know in the house hanging out doing our thing I am glad but also a little bit sad that my self-confidence body image chat seems to have resonated so much with you guys in the last video I'm sorry that you're also going through the same thing if you're watching this and you're like, yep, that was that was me. Um, but it did feel really nice to know that I'm not alone in this and that, you know, we're all in this together. And again, it's just a, just a stage of life. You'll hear me say that a lot, but it's true. My therapist always says, you know, the, the thing about the human brain that's sometimes great and sometimes kind of unfortunate is we tend to feel like whatever situation we're in is like our permanent situation. And the truth is, is that life is so fluid and dynamic and constantly changing, especially when you have kids. Um, but that's not actually the case. And so I try to remind myself that like the stage of life that we're in right now, where I'm like not feeling super confident, getting to know my own, you know, new postpartum body. And I have, you know, this very demanding stage with my children. Like it's beautiful in a lot of ways, but it's also, you know, fleeting and it won't be like this in a few years. And really like the years that your kids are small feel so long and so consuming. But when you are at the end of your life, like you look back on them as like a blip. Um, and that doesn't necessarily help in the moment sometimes. But it is good perspective for me to remember at the end of the day when I'm like, how am I going to do this for the next, you know, 40 years? It's like, you're not. You don't, you don't have to. Like, this is not a long-term situation. I saw recently on Pinterest that the new, like, makeup trend is cold girl, which basically just involves a lot of, like, blush over, like, the bridge of your nose to make you look like you're cold. And uh, I do that anyway, and I'm also always cold. So, like, easy trend, you know? Oh, I didn't even bring... An eyeshadow brush down. And I am too lazy to go get one now. Maybe I do need a brush because I just totally smeared that. <laughs> it's fine. Maybe I'll blend it a little bit more when I go up to get Rowan. He's really sleeping in. It's past eight right now and he's he's still out. I swear he's going through a growth spurt or something because he's just been like eating a ton recently and sleeping a ton. So I think he's growing. I feel like I low-key don't even need mascara, but I recently got this like tubing formula and it's new to me. I'm excited to try it, so I'm gonna do it anyway. This is supposed to like not transfer onto like your under eye area. And I feel like at the end of the day, I always have so much mascara in that area. So we'll see if this works or not. Okay, I'm gonna have one more go at covering up this scab that I have from picking at my face because I cannot be stopped. And there's my makeup. Less than 10 minutes, including a lot of talking to the camera. That's all I got time for. Let's go get dressed, Ginny girl. Let's go get dressed. <laughs> are you so excited to show them your outfit of the day? So here are the girls' outfits. I'm wearing my present over perfect tee from my merch launch with this little Amazon bandana headband. <laughs> You're so stoked, huh? And these wide leg crop pants from Madewell. And then Missy May is wearing this adorable little plaid dress Whoa. with a lace collar and some little hair bows that I got in a mega pack on Amazon that she wears all the time. And these socks. That's what we look like. And I think Rowan's up. So we're going to go see if he's ready to get out of his crib. Sometimes he likes to just hang out in his crib for a little bit in the morning. Um, he hasn't called for me yet, I don't think. But we're going to go see if we can convince him to get up anyway. Good morning. You were calling for Dada. Yeah. Dada's at work today. I'm sorry. You want to come hang out downstairs with Mama and Sissy? Oh, I Dada 
You were hearing Dada? Yeah. Dada's not here, hon. It was just Mama. <laughs> Let's go potty and then go have breakfast. <laughs> no. Okay, you want to just hang out for a little while in your room? Okay, we can do that first. Why here? You dropped the both of them out of your crib? Yeah. So pretty soon we're going to say bye-bye to Big Keys. Why say bye-bye to Big Keys? So we don't want to mess up your teeth. Okay, you ready to read? Yeah. Richard scaries cars and trucks from A to Z. Yeah. <laughs> What's coming down the road in Busy Town? <laughs> Ambulance, apple car, <laughs> banana mobile, bug dozer. Where's the bug dozer? That's not the bug dozer. Where's the bug dozer? Yeah, there you go. Corn car, crayon car. Going up, down, up, down. Oh. <laughs> Pencil car, pickle car, and don't forget the. This is happening up here. Looking extra yeah. sweet today. Bonk. Roll over. Yeah. Rowan's outfit is from Walmart. It's such a good dupe of the do, 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 Plastic tab that you asked me for help with. How we turn it around? It's a little tricky. You have to open the two sides and then twist it out. Uh -uh. Okay. You can get your bagel. Yeah. One second. Right now, I'm making some toast. I will when I'm done making the toast. Okay. chair from dinner last night because I did not get to it. You're welcome. Love, 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 love this wipeable high chair cushion. I'll link it for you. All right, sissy girl, you ready for some toast? You ready for some toast? Love me so much? Yeah. That's nice. Thanks, bud. I love you. Yes, but I love you. Yes, but monk. <gasps> what? <laughs> you help me, mama. Boy, <laughs> are you happy, mama? I am. I'm so happy. I am the happiest mommy in the whole world. You know why? Yeah. Why? It's tight, mama. Oh, it's too tight? Yes. Why is mommy the happiest mommy in the whole world?
It is almost 10 o'clock and I'm just now getting around to making my coffee. I'm using my homemade syrup, which is definitely in a bud vase. Whatever works. You wanna go outside when Sissy goes down for a nap? She's already been up for two hours, so that should be super soon. Just run on mommy and you, mama. Just run on mommy. No. Okay. It's a date. <laughs> Are you snoring? I get the hanky. I got them in my eye. Yeah, let's not throw our food around. We didn't realize you had crumbs in your hand, huh? What's my alley? That yummy toast. Is that yummy toast? Yeah. Yeah. Why did I have them, Pico? All right, let's see what's on the cleaning checklist today. Bedrooms. So she's about to go down for a nap, so I think I'll change her sheets and just kind of pick up in her room. I actually just vacuumed her the other day, so I think I'm good on that for her room. We'll see if we can get that done before she goes to sleep. Okay, here's the current state of things. Not too bad, honestly. We mostly just need to change her crib sheet and I have a basket of laundry to bring up to put away for her. <laughs> How's your room, kiddo? Can you put your books back on your bookshelf? In your room? What's with my bookshelf? In your room. I'm going to turn this off for you, Mama. Okay, yeah, you can turn that off. Thank you for asking. future Megan here to talk to you guys about the sponsor of today's video, which is Whatnot. I'm sure you guys already know by now because I've already worked with them a few times that Whatnot is my favorite place to buy lightly used and new kids clothes from some of my favorite brands through a live shopping experience. I have enjoyed my time on there as a seller so, so much. And one of the most common questions that I get when I do a Q and A is how do I make money as a stay at home mom? So today I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about becoming a whatnot seller and how it is the perfect side hustle for moms. You can join a community of other thrifty moms and make real life friends on the app. And it's great because when you have small children and they're constantly growing out of sizes of clothing, you have constant inventory. If you wanted to sell even more items, you could totally kill two birds with one stone and make some extra money and get some outings out of it by taking your kiddos with you to like the thrift store or consignment store to source really cool pieces. This can be completely at your pace. You decide when your shows are, nobody's telling you what to do or what to sell, and you're teaching your kid business skills. I'm going to be doing a live on Whatnot going through all of your questions about being a Whatnot seller, so if you have any, leave them in the comments. I'll put the date and time of the show right here since I'm not quite sure yet when I'm filming this, when it's gonna be. As an exclusive bonus, when you sign up through my link, you can get $25 in giveaway credit for your first show. And I cannot stress to you how cool this is. It's the marriage of the community aspect for me with the ability to make extra income. Like I have literally just pulled stuff out of my closet that's been 
been sitting there for years and made like $550 in a live stream. And that's just like mind blowing to me because I had all those items on like Poshmark or Mercari for like over a year. And then I went on whatnot and made some extra money right away. If you're interested in signing up as a seller and you wanna get that $25 giveaway credit, make sure you use the link in my description because I don't think they're doing this with anybody else. So you have to use that specific link to get it. And make sure you tag me on there when you have your first show so I can come and hang out and shop all of your kiddos closets. Matt and I's room is a hot mess because we finally started work on the bathroom again. So a couple days ago, we ripped out the majority of this tub. There's like a little piece of it there because we need a plumber to come in and like look at this situation. But we are finally moving again after months. And I think that this is probably like the hardest part. So next we'll be demoing the shower and then we'll call a plumber in. And hopefully they'll do their thing and then we'll demo the floor and then it's off to the races. But I'm just happy we got moving again because we did not touch this for months. But it does mean there is a lot of construction and bathroom stuff on my floor, which is not ideal. So I'm at least going to try to change the sheets right now. And then I'll probably work on picking some of this up and tidying it after the kids go to bed tonight. Rock-a-bye, baby. On the treetop, when the bell breaks, the cradle will fall, and down will come baby, cradle and all. I need to see girl. Have a good sleep. I love you. Your mama's. Yama. Llama. Yeah. No, you're my best friend. Best friend. Yeah. <laughs> what did you do set up, Mama? Uh, I'm folding it and putting it back in my drawer. So I only wore it for a few hours yesterday. It's called Teddy Grams, Mama. Yes, they're called Teddy Grams. Okay. Teddy Grams, Quackers, Mama. Yeah. Hey, Ron, can you pick up your Teddy Grams, please? Because I'm taking the sheets off the bed. What did you just say? Show your beans. Show my beans? Where did you learn that? It's from Banded. Oh, it's from Bluey. It's from Banded. You are a funny dude, kiddo. No, I don't like bullying your bed. <laughs> I thought you said you wanted to go outside. I, I want to watch 
bully. I don't want to watch bully. Mama. Whoosh. Get me night night. Get you night night. Oh, okay. <gasps> Good night. Tuck you in. Tuck you in. Good night. Um, um, Rowan has requested some bluey, which honestly is fine by me because I have an Instagram campaign that I need to post. So real life, I'm going to sit with him here while he watches TV and do a little bit of work on my phone. What is that? What do you call the mama? Teddy grams. Teddy grams. Are they yummy? Yeah. Have you ever tried those before? Yeah. Today was your first time, huh? Yeah. What episode of Bluey do you want to watch? Well, we, one while you're driving. The one where they're driving? Yes. The taxi one or the bus one? The bus one. Okay. No harm, please. <laughs> Had to take advantage of this beautiful sunshine we're getting, so Rowan and I are outside. Instagram stories posted, Sissy's still asleep, and I'm just checking on all my little sprouts here. So exciting, there's so many tulips coming up, and it looks like quite a few ranunculus too. I think those are the ranunculus. It looks like the, um, what's the other thing that I planted? Two kinds of tulips, and, is that it? Two kinds of tulips and ranunculus? Oh no, I, po I, I planted an anemone. I think that's how you say that. Uh, it does not look like they are coming up. So that's a little sad, but the sunshine is glorious. Right in your car? Pass me, mama. Okay. Oh, it's hard to push you on the bumpy grass. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry if this vlog is like literally so boring. This is just a very average mundane day in the life, but I just like wanted to vlog one of those when I like didn't have any activities planned. I really get like mixed messages from some people who are like, I like the aesthetic, like more planned stuff. And some people who are like, I like just the real raw unedited kind of a thing. So let me know which you guys prefer. Um, or if I should just continue to do a mix of both. Because some days I have more energy and I plan things and we do activities. I'm fixing the wall, Mama. Oh, okay, thanks for fixing the wall. I'm, I'm always... And some days like this, it's just kind of chill life with the kiddos. And I don't know, they're both a part of my life. So I feel like maybe I'll keep doing both. I don't know, tell me what you guys think. I do have one little like baking activity to yeah. do with Rowan at later in the day that's like three ingredients that are already made and we're just gonna put little teddy grams and cute little puff pastry beds. Um, so hopefully we'll get to that. But that's about all I have the energy for today. <laughs> Oh, 
you want to get in my jacket. I see. Okay, wait. Don't put your feet in. now. Rowan's down for his nap and my mother-in-law is over so that I can go and take a walk. During my therapy session, I do therapy from two to three, like twice a month. So I'm going to go and do that. It's cold out there. But I'm looking forward to the sunshine at least. And then by the time I get back, we'll probably both be down. So hopefully we can have a nice chill afternoon. Mr. Rowan's awake. We had a sad wake up, huh? But now we're going to make some treats. We got out some puff pastry and some chocolate and Teddy Grahams. We're gonna make these little things I saw on Instagram um, from the Quendi home. I'm gonna eat some. This isn't ready yet, but you can have some chocolate. I'm gonna, uh, I want to eat it out of your bowl. Here, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put some on here. Can you put some on the squares? No. Okay, you don't have to. That's okay. Tell me if you wanna help me make the treats, okay? Up. Oh, come here. <clears throat> I got you. That's okay. Nobody gets sad sometimes, huh? When I'm going to eat some of that. Well, let's bake it first so we have enough. I just want to eat this and cake. Um, how about I get you some chocolate chips to eat? Yeah. Okay. I, want, I want to dump some in, Mama. <laughs> Okay, let's put the little teddies in their beds first. <laughs> we, wrap, we way wrap them up. Almost. I think we got one more here. One more here. Oh, so cute. What do you think? Is that good? <laughs> Should we do some more like that? We can eat some more here. Yeah. I'll get you some chocolate chips after. And we're going to put these in the oven and then we can eat these too. Sound good? Good. Oh. Put it on there and then you brush it on this part. Oh, mm -hmm. I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Let's we mix it, Mama. Yeah, you can mix it first if you want. I can eat it. Oh, no, don't eat it because it's raw. Nice. Great job. I'm going to get some on a teddy bear. Go like that first. I think he's good now. He's playing with Nana for a few more minutes before she heads out. Does anybody else have that happen where your kids just wake up like super sad and inconsolable? I don't know what it is. If so, what do you do? Because I feel like with him, nothing helps. Like we just have to ride it out for like a good 10 minutes until we're able to like distract him but he's not receptive at all to anything for those first 10 minutes. And I always feel so bad. I don't know if he like has nightmares or what, but kiddo wakes up sad sometimes. Matt's also home from work now. He brought me this giant iced coffee. I won't drink it all today, but so good. Chocolates came out looking oh. like. How's my hand, Mama? Okay. Maybe I need to scooch you a little bit. Okay. I'm ready to take a big bite. I, I want to use. You want that one? Yes. I want to. I don't hold it. Yeah, you can hold it. Very, very cute. Do you want? You want a bite? Oh, I get one. Yeah. Cheers, Ron. Mm. You didn't waste any time, huh? What do we think? Mmm, very flaky. Good. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> very messy, though. 
Anyways, I think I'm going to end the vlog here because it's pretty much time for us to make dinner. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. I know it was just kind of a boring, mundane day in the life, but that's my real life for you. It's basically just cleaning, preparing food, and hanging out with my kids. I love you guys a lot, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye! Bye! I follow only golden, 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 golden things, golden, I follow only golden.